Here's what we look like right now. This is from our Children's of Alabama camera. We're looking back over I-65. Quite a few folks out and about this Friday evening and no threat of rain through the rest of the evening. But what we are watching are a few high clouds that are streaming into our state. Those will build in overnight and we will have a partly cloudy night. But by tomorrow, those clouds move on out and we're left with full sunshine throughout the day. Let's break down the next 12 hours. We will be falling through the 50s overnight and by early tomorrow morning, we have a mixture of 40s and 50s in the forecast. It's going to be warmer than where we were this morning. So if you are going to be up early, still feels cool, but not nearly as cold as we started this morning. And this is very close to where we would expect to be this time of the year. Although we do start in the 40s, check it out. We end up in the upper 70s tomorrow under full sunshine. For Easter Sunday, we start the day in the mid 50s and we end up in the low 80s in a lot of spots with just a few clouds. And then by Monday, more locations reach into the low 80s with clouds building head in ahead of our next system. Let's break down the day Sunday. I know we've got a lot of plans for Easter Sunday. If you're going to be at any kind of sunrise services, we'll be in the mid 50s to start the day by lunchtime, mid 70s, and then throughout the afternoon and evening. We're going to be in the low 80s and upper 70s. Couldn't ask for a better spring forecast for Easter weekend. We do have some springtime thunderstorms in the forecast, though, on Tuesday. The Storm Prediction Center is including the northern third of the state with a risk of a couple strong storms. So basically, we're going to have scattered storms moving in through the second half of the day. Rainfall totals appear to be less than one inch, so this is not going to be a big rain producer for us, but we could have a couple strong thunderstorms that could mean a few severe thunderstorm warnings. We'll be watching this system carefully and updating this forecast as we get closer to Tuesday. Monday, we are going to be uh, really watching the increase in cloud cover ahead of that system. Temperatures are very warm throughout the early morning hours. Tuesday thunderstorms are still holding to our north, but during the second half of the day, that's when our coverage of thunderstorms looks to increase across the state, and then those storms will be exiting by early on Wednesday morning. So here's a closer look at the next seven days. Weekend looks absolutely beautiful. No weather trouble on Monday. We do have those clouds building in and then we're expecting rain and thunder on Tuesday. Be sure you're checking back on the forecast between now and Tuesday for the latest details.